<laughs> Speaking of open minds, how, where are you on the rotation situation since we saw you last? Well, you know, I still think we got a lot of guys to play. I'm, I'm not sure. I, we, we're definitely got, we're not going to start the same group we started the other night, but uh, uh, we're still kind of trying to figure out how to come out of the gate. But I think you still have nine, ten guys. You got to get in there. Is there kind of a timetable on when you would like to kind of have that shortened a little bit? Or is it just, hey, we'll see when we see? I think it has to play itself out, you know. Or I think it really does. And, and uh, uh, hopefully, you know, with this stretch that we have, the one thing I talked to him about yesterday is, you know, it's a heck of a nine-day stretch starting with yesterday's practice through Tuesday's game next week against Duquesne. I think we're going to have a, a much better feel of rotation and who we should start and those type of things, you know, after this stretch. Is there any scenario where you can have a comfort zone in playing nine or ten guys most uh, of the time? Yeah, I think you can. I think you. I think you can with nine. I think it's hard with ten. Uh, you know, but I think you. I think you can with nine. And, and uh, you know, so uh, I think I said this to you guys before. You know, it may be there. May, there's going to be a stretch. Stretches during the season where somebody's not in the rotation but he's a pretty good player and we, we've got to kind of keep him engaged mentally and physically and that's our assistants doing some extra workout videotape me bumping him because then all of a sudden maybe after three weeks he's back in there you know and we really haven't maybe had that I, I can't remember the last time we've had that dynamic with our team but I think that's something we've talked about as a staff does the competition level because that increases does that help as far as not experimenting a lot with rotations and guys and maybe being able to shave it down where yeah, you want to. Yeah, yeah, I think, you know, I mean, our practice, our practice, been, uh, the competition's great, obviously, as we change jerseys around, uh, you know, and, and, and so, yeah, it, it eventually play, kind of plays itself out. You know, the other thing that's been great is, knock on wood, we've been healthy, you know, we've been able to, everybody's been available to us, and, you know, today is practice number 28 since October 1st, you know, we, we kind of, you know, we've done a lot, you've heard me say, we've done a lot together with uh, this group, starting back with the foreign tour. Bradford's good, by the way, <laughs> Bradford's really good. You know, one of the things I told our guys yesterday, I said, um, Bradford went to the NSA tournament, we did not. They won a game in the NSA tournament. They've got a nucleus back of old guys that won 23 games. So, um, I, I mean, it's, it's a heck of a challenge for us. And if you could get it, you know, once you start playing real games, you start to create a resume, good or bad. This would be a good win for us at the end of the year if, if we can get it. But we, we got our hands full, and all I know is they've made 33s in two games, so they are really firing.